An Egypt airplane has made an emergency landing in Uzbekistan after receiving a bomb threat. According to Uzbekistan Airways, information was received about a possible device on board, which is now suspected to be a hoax. The plane was traveling from Cairo to Beijing when it had to make the unscheduled landing. All 118 people and 17 crew members on board have been safely evacuated from the Airbus A330. Security services at the Ungech International Airport have been examining the plane. Well, let's get to more details now on that story. And CCTV's Adil Makhru is joining me now from Cairo. Adil, what more details do we have of this emergency landing? What do we know? Well, basically, it's not um, the first uh, bomb scare or bomb threats that Egypt Air has received since a plane um, crashed um, uh, over a month ago um, at the Egyptian um, water, northern water borders. Um, a, a source from Egypt Air has been, um, I spoke to and he told us that um, it, it is more likely like every other day they receive a bomb threat, uh, whether it's a plane in Cairo or a plane on its way from other places from Cairo. All of them has been a hoax so far. Um, for this one in particular, as you said, the plane has um, landed after uh, Egypt Air has received an anonymous call here in Cairo saying that this specific flight has a bomb on board. Um, quickly, air control here in Egypt has contacted um, the plane a pilot and uh, ordered him to land in the nearest um, international airport, which was uh, uh, Ugech uh, International Airport in Uzbekistan, as you've mentioned. Uh, 118 members were on board and 17 um, crew members on that uh, flight. Um, they have quickly um, moved all passengers out from the plane. They've searched them. They've searched the plane thoroughly. And according to the latest report, they have found nothing at all, whether um, with the passengers or on board the plane. And the plane, um, the, the entire process of the checking has been um, ended. Well, uh, Adele, there were 118 people on board and uh, 17 crew members. Do we know yet the nationalities of those on board? And do we know exactly when that plane is likely to resume its flight? Well, um, we, we, Egypt Air has not released any detailed statement on the nationalities. Um, in fact, it is not obliged to us as far as nothing has happened. So uh, it has not released that. Uh, but it is expected in, in such routine um, trips from between Egypt and China that uh, many of them, uh, or at least most of them, will be Egyptians and Chinese um, traders or employees moving uh, forward and backwards from Cairo um, to Beijing. It's one of the uh, busiest flights that has been lately one of the busiest flights for Egypt Air um, in terms of the passenger capacity on the plane. The rest since the um, airplane crash and since the tourism industry has collapsed have been quite minimal. Um, so that's what we can say so far, but nothing official, of course, uh, in that regards. About when the plane will resume, it is expected that the plane has already um, resumed its flight. Uh, we're talking about an hour ago where the um, latest report has come and indicated that all the search process have ended. So nothing yet official has been announced, but that was an hour ago. And so in terms of uh, regular um, procedures, then the plane should be in air on its way back to Beijing. Right, Adil Mahrui for us there in Cairo. Thank you.